Welcome to DataCamp. This course will equip you with the tools and best practices to help you create an engaging and effective course on our platform. My name is Mari, the head of curriculum at DataCamp, and I'll help you get started. As with any good course, let's start with our learning objectives. By the end of this course, you'll have a clear understanding of our content creation process. This will include the various phases in the process, who you'll be working with at DataCamp during each phase, how long each phase will take, and the deliverables you're expected to complete per phase. You'll also be introduced to the various tools and workflows we use to ensure your course is designed as quickly and effectively as possible. Most importantly, you'll learn about the underlying pedagogical principles that make every DataCamp course a success and how to apply them to your own course. Every course we create at DataCamp follows the same process to ensure quality and efficiency. There are a total of three phases. In this lesson, we'll give you a quick overview of the three phases. You'll go into more detail in subsequent lessons. The first phase is course design. During this phase, you will work closely with the curriculum lead from DataCamp's curriculum team to design the contents of your course. Imagine your course as a house you want to build. You wouldn't start building the house without having a clearly planned blueprint first, right? You'd need to ask yourself, what materials do I need to build the house? Where will the entrance be? Will there be a second floor? How many bedrooms? In this first phase, you'll build your course's blueprint. And just like the blueprint, you'll spend time creating a thoughtful, detailed outline of the contents of your course. Please note that we often refer to your blueprint as course specifications, or course specs for short. Which concepts will you teach first? How will they tie in together? Which datasets or packages do you need to include for learners to apply these concepts? How can you apply your learning objectives to DataCamp exercises? This is where you'll get the chance to answer these questions and many more. This phase normally takes about four to five weeks to ensure the blueprint for your course is ready for implementation, just like your house would be ready for construction. Once you have your course specs or course blueprint in hand, you move on to the course development phase. This is where the implementation of your course begins. Here, you'll work with a content developer from our content development team. And just like a construction project manager, our content developers will make sure the implementation of your course stays true to your blueprint and help you stay on track to launch your course within the agreed timeline. Here, you'll deliver all of the chapters, lessons, and exercises of your course using our course editor. You'll also record your course once the content is finalized. This phase normally takes about three months to complete, but once it's finished, your course will be live on our platform, just like your house would be ready for its owners. Now that your house is built and the owners have moved in, you'll need to keep an eye on it. The final phase of course creation is course maintenance and continues as long as your course is live on our platform. Now, while you took all the necessary precautions to build the best house possible, sometimes things break over time, like a leaky faucet, for example. And just like you'd want to fix that faucet, you'll want to monitor your course and ensure you're able to address issues as they arise. This can mean anything from fixing a typo to updating packages, all to ensure a continued positive and effective learner experience. But don't worry, you're not alone. Our content quality analyst will assist you should you need help. You will be able to monitor your course's performance with our content quality dashboard. But we'll dive into that in a later chapter, so no need to worry about that now. A course is easier to build than a house, right? Now let's make sure you have a clear understanding of the course creation.